happy May 1st. Boy, do I have a story for you this morning. So let's rewind to last night. I could not fall asleep for the life of me. Like I literally was tossing and turning and I was like, something is wrong. Like I just had a really weird gut feeling that something was very, very, very wrong. So finally around midnight, which again is so late for me, like I'm usually fast asleep like a little baby by 9, 9.30, but anyway, so midnight rolls around, I'm on my phone, and I'm like, oh, I know what's wrong, the Instagram subscriptions that I was so excited, I literally have like 12 videos edited, ready to go for, isn't gonna work. I made a mistake. I made a huge mistake. So when I first started researching Instagram subscriptions, there was a long form video feature built in, kind of similar to like IGTV, if you remember what that is. They took that feature away, like very recently, and I didn't know that. And so <laughs> at midnight, I'm like, like I want to launch these videos tomorrow. What the heck am I supposed to do? So instead of going to sleep and just figuring it out today, I was like, no, I woke up, went onto my computer, learned how to use Vimeo, bought a website, figured out how to get subscribers. I struggle a lot with perfectionism. It stops me from doing a lot of things and especially in this line of work where I'm a little bit of an entrepreneur and I have to like launch things. I, I've i never really launched things <laughs> because I get so in my head and I'm like, well, it has to be so perfect. This was a real test. This was a real test <laughs> to that. And I am going to launch because I know that I want to. And even though this isn't the most perfect way and it's not what I had in my head over the last few months of filming, that's okay. I'm rolling with the punches as they say. So you can still subscribe to me, just not via Instagram. You can subscribe to me via my website on Vimeo. I will have a link in the description if you're interested. It's actually just called Move XX Maya. That is the link that you click and then it will take you. You can still buy for $9.99 a month. It's a similar setup, just a different vehicle for getting there and that's okay. Now, it is literally 8.30 in the morning it's gloomy out, which is not exciting, but that's okay. I have a hair appointment and I literally need to leave in like It looks so good. I'm literally obsessed with my hair lady. She is just the cutest little thing ever. Oh my god, and when I was walking back to my car, there were two girls and they were just passing out flowers. And they gave me one and it was really sweet and really cute. It made my day because this morning was extremely chaotic. Last night was extremely chaotic. And I feel like when I started this vlog, I was like, oh dear lord, why am I even doing this? But no, everything worked out and I'm literally so grateful for that and now i can focus on this actual video hello i feel like i haven't even introduced myself but hey i'm vlogging packing and prepping for mexico 
obviously step one was getting a little hair refresh the rest of today i really just have a lot of work to do since i'm gonna be gone in mexico for a whole week i want to make sure that i have content pre-filmed brainstormed i need to get to like my emails just get a lot of like admin work and filming work done before we go to mexico so that's pretty much what i'm gonna do for the rest of today get to that but the main thing that I need to do today is clean I want to deep clean so that when we come back from our vacation the house is tidy if you watched my last vlog you know that I make a packing list before I actually start packing it just helps me organize my ideas I also for Mexico specifically like to try on some of the outfits before like some of my dinner outfits or outfits that I know I'm gonna want to shoot content in so yeah packing list cleaning today it's honestly gonna be a chill day which I'm excited for because I was so tired yesterday. Honestly, I still want to go get coffee. I want to go get coffee every day, but I think we might hit blue bottle in a little bit. Don't mind my washer, but does it look like I'm wearing pajamas? Like, I can't... Or maybe if I did, like, a crossbody, this would be better. Yeah, wait. Actually, I feel like this is cuter. Yay. The most important thing in my purse is this lip oil. It's so good. And it's so cute. Tell everyone what happened. <laughs> it's, it's <laughs> That's what happened. <laughs> Why don't we stop her? Oh yeah. Making my way downtown, driving fast, going to get blue bottled. Da 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 da. That's a new princess. Blue bottle got a new breakfast sandwich. It used to be like a croissant, but now it's on an English muffin. Oh, there's two of them. Oh my God, it looks so messy. The other one was messy too though, so. Okay. 
It's an English muffin, egg, spinach, I don't know, cheese maybe? Honestly, it's really good. I think I like it more than the croissant one. All I did was work from home and I fell asleep before I could start packing. <laughs> so we're gonna pack everything tonight. If I sound chaotic, it's because I am. Mercury is retrograding. There's an eclipse going on. The universe is chaos and I am manifesting that chaos, unfortunately. It is, okay, 9.02. I quite literally need to leave like right now to go get a mini petty. This is the fit. It's raining, so I didn't want to wear like close down shoes, so hopefully that's fine. But yeah, obviously we need some fresh nails before Mexico. Let's go. insert it on the screen so that's kind of my base idea of the things that I need I think we're gonna need the biggest suitcase that I own because I'm gonna be there for a whole week we're also gonna start with bathing suits because I'm the most excited to wear bathing suits yes yes this one's iffy. This is just the skirt, but yes. Let's fucking the bottom. Wait, I'm confused. Yes. Um, maybe. Yes, all of my Frankie's bikinis are like immediately yes because they're just so cute and they all fit me so well. Yes. Yes, okay, wait. So I actually still have this in the plastic because I just bought this, but it is quite possibly the thing I'm most excited, or at least the bikini I'm most excited to wear. It's from same Los Angeles and it cost me an extreme amount of money, but it was literally my only birthday present. <laughs> so that's okay. But literally look at how cute. Okay, these are the bottoms. So cute. And then I really liked the strapless top that they sell in this like print, but they didn't have it in my size. So I just got the triangle top and it is still really, really cute. Like the flower on it is just adorable and 
I love a black and white bikini, so immediately yes. Yes, oh my god, why is this so long? Oh, I think it like <laughs> wraps around you. Honestly, my favorite part about the base luggage is that they all come with these like bags. They're called the dirt bags and you can put your dirty clothes in them. It's so nice for like beach vacation specifically because when your bathing suits are still kind of like damp, like if they don't end up drying all the way, I feel like whatever bathing suit I wear the last day we're there, it never fully dries before I have to pack it back up. And that drives me absolutely insane. But I can put it in here, that way it won't get my other clothes like all gross. So I'm gonna put all of my bathing suits into this. Actually, I could fit them in the small one. That fit perfectly. Yay. Okay, bathing suits are done. Unfortunately, I already need a break. Um, I think Trent and I are gonna go shopping because there's one outfit. Pause. Here is said outfit. Oh my god, it's not that cute from <laughs> this angle, but it's a dress from Aritzia. The back is like cut out and cute. Anyway, I'm wearing it to a brunch that we're going to, I want to say Sunday. It's my favorite restaurant. I'm not going to say in the world because that's kind of ballsy, but it is definitely my favorite restaurant in Mexico. And I've been to Mexico like seven times by now in my life. Anyway, it's my favorite restaurant and we're going for brunch. And so I really wanted to wear this dress. It's so cute. I got it from Aritzia. Okay, originally it's like $88. I got this dress for $25 because it was on sale and they just happened to have one left in my size. Talk about fate, but I really wanna wear brown cowboy boots like with it. Like I have the image in my head, like cute headband, cute braids, cowboy boots, this dress. I don't have cowboy boots. I have one pair, but they're like an off-white and I tried them on with the dress and it's just like not the vibe. So I think I can convince Trent to take me shopping right now to go try to find some cowboy boots and then we'll resume packing later. We got matching shoes on. I told you they didn't. They weren't gonna go up that high. It does, it does look good. shopping so I'll be like oh my god that dress is so cute but I'm only gonna get it if they have it in my size and of course they have it in my size so I had to get it it is like a crocheted little mini dress I don't know I think it's very Mexico and honestly I would totally wear this in the summer just out in LA too so I don't regret but the main event we went on a mission to find brown cowboy boots and that I did. These are stunning. And unfortunately, I might have to wear them to the airport. I hope that they fit in my bag. <laughs> all right, so I have all of my bathing suits, two dresses, <laughs> and some boots. I really need to get it together because I'm actually getting so tired and I just don't want to do this anymore. So we're just gonna do it 
super fast. Pretty much done packing. I think the only thing left is like some skincare, my carry on, and like things that I'm gonna throw in quickly in the morning. So thank you so much for watching. I know this was a bit of a chaotic vlog, but yeah, don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in Mexico.